All right, folks, it's Thursday, day before video day. We got yet another game room deal to go make right now. Two wee bundle lots. Just check out what we got cooking. Welcome to Crack and Resale. This is a show where we go around and we buy video games and other resale inventory in order to make a living on Amazon and eBay. If that sounds like your cup of tea, hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, and come along for the journey, people. It's fun times. Guys, we are back home and we have got these, ah, we've got these games for the game room. Yeah, Autumn, check it out, it's awesome. Cabela's, it came with the U-Draw set along with uh, the gun for Wings Crossbow Training. Came with Wii Sports, Wii Sports Resort. Guys, guys, oh my, what? What a pickup! All right, guys, later in the video, we're gonna have details regarding our game room series that we're doing right now, the Build the Game Room series. That's transforming into something different. Stick to this, uh, stick around for the details later in the video. The next morning. All right, y'all, it is Friday. It's the heart sale and video day. About to go out and see what we can't find. Let's get it. Hey, good morning. Good morning, how are you? Pretty good. You got any video games for sale by chance? No, unfortunately I don't. Oh, good. Thank you. Nice to get up and get moving. Good morning. Good morning, how are you? Pretty good. Ooh. See you guys got some games over here. Yeah, we got all kinds of games. What's two on the oh, that's, game? That's really, that's, that's such a good idea. And a yeah. <laughs> Is there a price that you wanted to do on the whole box? The whole box? Yeah, the whole box. The whole box. The whole box. <laughs> um, well, <laughs> but leave enough on the bone so when he sells them, he can make some. Yeah, uh, yeah pretty. I don't know. What do you think? I mean, mm, let's see what you got here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, three. Uh, oh, okay. You have the console as well. I have the console. I don't have the remotes. Oh, okay. I think you could get oh, those. Yeah, yeah. I can. I can order those offline. Yeah. Um. Okay, so you got fifty games in here. Okay. One, two, three, four. Seven, fifteen. So sixty-five games and a console. What? What? what a, how about a dollar for each? And then I have ten on the on the console. That's fair. Is that fair? That's, I think that. Yeah. Yeah. So about yeah, seventy-five. I mean, yeah, seriously. Fair. I, I mean, yeah, nobody fair. plays with these. Yeah, we'll do seventy-five. Okay. That's fair. Yep. You can have the whole box. Oh, okay. okay. Hi, puppers. Hi. Hi. Oh, you want to play a fetch? I actually. Ooh, folks, we just got out of that sale. Oh, what a banger that was. First sale of the day, too. Can you believe that? A stack of 65 games in a PS3 console for 75 bucks? Woo! <laughs> Morning. Wait, are these all Jackie Chan movies? Yes. Really? Yes. Huh? Are you a lover of Jackie Chan? I do like Jackie Chan. I, I, I like some. I like Rush Hour movies. I don't have. I don't have a VHS player. <laughs> oh. Wow. Because I was here. The box. You're a big fan of Jackie Chan, huh? No, I'm not. My 
sun is. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You don't happen to have any more games out and about, do you? Well, I, did, I didn't know the games were in there. No. Okay. No. All right. Well. So. Hmm. Probably a dollar each. Huh? Oh, well, I don't, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, I can do a dollar each on these. You don't yeah. want any other things? No, I'm good on the Jackie Chan's. Yeah, <laughs> I thought it was kind of cool. I know cool, the VHS but... are mostly on the bottom, but there's a lot of the movies, DVDs. Oh, there's I some DVDs. I get DVDs in there, too. Okay. Like 14 here. of them. If you want to go through okay. and see if you've seen them all. Okay. My, my son collects them. I'll probably pass on those, but I'll grab these these two from you. Okay. Look out. Let's see out over here. Do you like Bruce Willis? Somewhat, yeah. There was a couple in, I think, and let me get you. Oh, Thelma, do you have any one? Yeah, I do. I need three right now. Because I had some Bruce Willis if you wanted to look at them, but you're not being. Yeah, I'm, I'm good. I, I got. Give you five. Okay. Do that, and I'll get the five then. Okay. <coughs> Sweet. Three. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate Enjoy. it. Thanks, I will. <laughs> $20 pickup right here, $20 in profit. I haven't checked this aggressive inline. We'll check that later. All right, guys, it's Saturday. It's a busy day. It's time to go through these collections that we picked up over the weekend. So check it out. We picked up all this for $50 each, two lots, $50 each, $100 total. So we got these 31 games right here. And each of those games are worth about a dollar to four dollars a piece. Nothing over five dollars in that stack. It came with four Wii remotes with the Wii Motion Plus adapters. These sell pretty dang good. Two Wii consoles. This Lynx crossbow set. That thing's like new in box. Same with this Wii cleaning kit and the U-Draw. It also came with the Wii Fit balance board and we fit plus which actually does net us good money this gets us about 46 dollars off of amazon and it has a really good sales rank but guys pretty much the way that i comped out this deal i saw three things that that really i knew that it was going to be profitable so we sports resort we sports both in their sleeves that's like 60 dollars right there and then I I would you know I estimated the the price of the bundles to be around like you know a hundred and a hundred and twenty if I bundled that up with the black one so that would pay for the lot and the rest would be icing on the cake for us ah but check out these games that we found in this lot I wasn't expecting it guys I was not expecting this one bit so we got the go vacation okay twelve dollars twelve dollars no big deal no big deal got the carnival mini golf six dollars. We got the crazy mini golf too, another six dollars. But guys, we had a sealed banger in this lot, y'all. This is a Gunblade New York Special Air Assault Force and Arcades Hit Pack out of Sega. It is sealed in the package and it is worth over one hundred dollars alone. Over one hundred dollars alone for this bad boy. Woo, golly, I tell you what, folks, I'm going to get to testing these consoles real quick, and I'm going to go ahead and enter all of this into a seller list, at least what I can sell, and I'll get back to you with a final number about what we're going to be putting towards the game room challenge. All right, guys, I'm just going to be adding these Wii games and the consoles and everything to an existing batch that I already have going out this next week. Currently, the net profit on this batch is sitting at six hundred and seven dollars that just includes this stack right here that does not include any of the Wii stuff or anything like that yet so we'll go ahead and take the final number after that and subtract out this so subtract 607 from the final batch profit number folks here i was thinking that the big game hunter and the and this in this orange gun wasn't going to sell for anything it broke apart in two pieces it literally breaks apart and you can put it back together to make it easier to ship and package, I guess, for them. But, uh, literally, just the gun itself sold for, was selling for $20 on Amazon. And the game goes for less than a dollar. But you put them together and it's a $100 bundle right here. 
the, it's a hundred dollar bundle right here. Sells all day. Sells at least five times every six months. hundred dollars. Wild. Almost missed out on that money. If you know, you know, you know, and now you know. So, you know, you know. All right, guys, it's Sunday. I'm back to processing this collection today. I try not to work on Sundays, but I got to get this stuff done. The first Wii Bundle's all bundled up, boxed, and everything. This second white Wii Bundle that we got here. I'm donating one of the business's copies of Mario Kart Wii to create this into a Mario Kart Wii Bundle. That's going to raise the value on this. That's going to take that game room budget up. Just that little extra bit that we would, you know, that we might need to, to make a, a good solid purchase for it here soon. All right, folks. We finished up listing up this Wii lot. Total profit is chilling at $509. Let's minus our buy cost of 100 bucks. 409 going on the board toward the game room challenge. Now, obviously, we're going to have to give it a little bit of time before we can use that money to buy other things. Because this stuff does not sell instantly. I'm going to have to wait for it to actually sell. I do not have the money to, to cover that, to be honest. All right, folks, after processing through all those PS2 games from the yard sale on Friday, this week's shipment is sitting at $1,456 in net profit altogether. So far, $1,456 in this. And that doesn't even include the PS3 console down there that we got for $10 included in that lot as well. I don't have cords or controllers for that yet, but once I'm able to sell that, that should give me another $110 about after fees on Amazon. I just sold one probably three weeks ago for the same price. We've still got this lot of Wii games that we're going to have to put up on a, a short auction on ebay the next day well i ended up getting this original xbox and need for speed underground 2 from a yard sale this weekend for 20 dollars. my family ended up picking it up for me because i wasn't there which is very cool thank y'all thank y'all i just got done repairing this bad boy though what was wrong was in the disc drive the magnet it's just a bit too strong. It holds the disk drive shut. So I had to put a, just little tiny pieces of foam padding right above that magnet. But we've got it working now. It, we'll, be, we'll be sending this one off to Amazon as well. We just sold our last one that we sent in as well. We just sold that uh, just yesterday for like 185 on Amazon. After fees, it's probably coming out to like 140 150 in profit, which is sweet. Several days later. All right, folks, we're here at the Goodwill. Let's go see if we can't find anything to sell and flip for a profit on Amazon and eBay. We find whole lots of nothing in there. We struck out. Goodwill's been slacking recently. They've been putting everything online. It's driving me nuts. That's why I haven't been going as much. All right, folks, we struck out at the Goodwill. Hopefully we don't strike out at the GameStop. Let's go check it out. Probably make like 20 to 30 off that. There are no other FBA listings on the post right now, so it'll probably sell pretty quick. All right. All right, we're here at a yard sale of our friends. We got a whole stack of games okay. here. Doesn't want to charge. Oh. That's awesome, man. There's Thank that. you, sir. Bag of controllers. Looks like you came out to 69. Hey. Plus if you want to use card. <laughs> yeah, I'll do card. You want to do card? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Should be like 72. The ones I got from you last time were all fine. So, yeah. 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 All good. Where's the our consoles? Consoles. Almost forgot them. <laughs> there you go, my friend. Sweet man, good doing business. Good doing I business shall be back. You. Thank you, thank you. Thanks, man. Yep. Have a good Have one. Nice Excuse you. this here. How are you? Sick. Sick. All right, guys. So you just saw. We just got back from the yard sale. We got a whole, whole, whole stack of games here. This is probably. 
sub $100 in profit. Less than 100 bucks, but hey, still worth the pickups. Still worth the pickups for sure. I spent $69 there. Got that bag of games. We got an Xbox console. Now, if this boy works right here, if this boy works, and we can get some AV cables for it, this is $150 here. This is $150 in profit after fees. I just sold one for $185 on Amazon. After fees, that's like $150. It's, it's ha, solid profit there, people. I have extra, extra Xbox controllers as it is already. I know it's the S Blue A. Somebody's going to get a special controller with their Xbox. Who cares? News is I still have not finished this week's FBA shipment. Which is kind of a good thing because... Which is kind of a good thing, because now we have multiple consoles to go out with it. I have an Xbox One here. We have three PS3s. We have two Xboxes. That Xbox is going out. This Xbox 360 is going out. And this Xbox is also going out. We will catch up with you on the next video regarding the total potential profit value of this FBA shipment right here. We're switching up the challenge that we're doing a little bit. I'll tell you about that right now. The main series on this channel is no longer going to be building out this game room. That's going to come later. I've got something better in mind. All right, guys. Now, like I said before, the game room challenge is being transformed into something a little bit different. The game room challenge is being shown the door. But that same profit is not going to waste. See, the reason I'm changing things up is because... I don't like car compartmentalizing the business like this. I don't like having deals going to one thing and not to the overall picture. The whole point of this channel is to show you guys how to go out there, how to find video games, and how to make money on those video games. That's the whole point. The whole point is to show you guys hidden value in video games out in the wild and show you that you can make a living off of it. It can be done. The point of this channel is not to build a game room. I feel like I've sh I've strayed from the main point of this. And while it's supposed to be entertainment for you guys, I need to be providing you guys value. It's not not just providing myself value in the form of a game room. So while the game room is still going to happen, it's still going to happen eventually. I don't know when. It's going to happen. It's not going to be in the form of that series. But rather, right now, I would like to unveil a whole brand new series here. We're going to be doing what we're doing, but we're applying it into the overall picture. I want to challenge us to make $20,000 in sales on Amazon exclusively by the end of September. So by the beginning of October, we should have this challenge completed. If I end up reaching that goal, I will put $2,000 of my own money towards the game room. We could make wonders happen with that game room with $2,000. So look forward to that. If that happens in September, October, I'm going to be rewarding myself with a hell of a game room. The hell of a game room, people. So stick around, you know. Share the series. Help us grow here. This channel needs growth, y'all. I feel like we're providing people with a lot of value. It's good stuff, you know? And it's just, it's fun times. So come along for the $20,000 Summer Series Challenge. We have $3,616 going up on the summer sales board since the beginning of May. That leaves us with $16,384 more dollars of sales that we need to make by October. Let's get to it, y'all. As soon as I finish editing this video today, you guys are seeing the same day. As soon as I finish editing this video today, I'm finishing up on that FBA shipment, and I'm going to get out there looking for more game deals. Let's get it, y'all. Let's go. As you can see, though, moving the inventory is going well. It's getting there. We still have to make a lot of racks to get these other boxes up. Got them right here. Hi, Ace. Good boy. Good boy. We still have to make those racks, get those other boxes up on them. That way the eBay business continues to run smoothly. You know, we got we still have clothes going out every single week. This is still supplementing our income. It's good stuff, y'all. 
I'm thinking about continuing to make more longer form episodes like this. If you enjoyed this, let me know down in the comments. You have to tell me what you're enjoying to watch. You have to tell me. If I want to make this better, you guys got you to gotta provide me with the feedback, okay? If you enjoyed, like and subscribe. Comment down below. Hit the notification bell. That way you know whenever new episodes are coming out. New episodes every Friday, 4 p.m. Eastern. Come along for the journey, y'all. We appreciate you. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one. Yeah, it's music, man. Bye.